Hey, you guys got a quick word to share with you today. And the title is you're clean. It's time to forgive yourself. And you guys, this word isn't for everyone. So please take it to the Lord in prayer. Ask him for confirmation and always test the spirit behind every prophetic word, including mine. But if this message is for you, you have a history and you're looking at yourself and you're like, man, I, I feel so bad for what I've done. You know, I, I have this guilt and I have this shame. That is not of God. And, you know, break agreement with guilt. Break agreement with shame. The Holy Spirit convicts but it's the enemy who condemns us. It is not the Holy Spirit trying to make you live in guilt or trying to make you live in shame. This is not of God, you guys. You're clean. It doesn't matter how far down you fell. It doesn't matter where you came from. Maybe you were addicted, an ex-witch. Maybe you were in a gang. Maybe you've hurt some people. You know what? If you have come out of sin cycles and you have turned your life over to Jesus Christ and you have asked him to forgive you and you've repented of your sins, then you are clean. The Lord really put this on my heart to share with you today because there are a lot of people who need to hear this. Maybe you haven't even been able to forgive yourself for what you've done in the past. And the Lord is saying, you know what, if I have forgiven you, why aren't you forgiving you? And there's a song that the Holy Spirit put on my heart to share regarding this message. And it's the song, it's titled Clean, and it's by Natalie Grant. And I want to read some of the lyrics to you. I would really encourage you to go listen to it. It's absolutely beautiful. But it says, I see shattered and you see whole. I see broken, but you see beautiful. And you're helping me to believe you're restoring me piece by piece. There's nothing too dirty that you can't make worthy. You wash me in mercy. I am clean. If you've repented, then Jesus Christ has washed you. You are clean. You are clean by the blood of the lamb. And the scripture reference the Lord gave me for this word is 2 Corinthians 5, 17. And it reads, therefore, if anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. All things have passed away. Behold, all things have become new. So forget about the past. Forget about what you've done. I don't care if you were in prison for robbery. Uh, it doesn't matter. The Lord has made you clean. You are now clean. So it's just time to forgive yourself, believe what God says about you, and move on. So let's pray together. Lord, I just thank you that you are opening up every single eye to see, God, who they are in you, God. That you have created them as new creations in Christ Jesus, that the old has passed away. Behold, all things are brand new. And I thank you, God, that they are seeing themselves through your eyes, through the lens of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus, we pray. God, I thank you that this word gets to the right people. And I thank you, God, for blessing them and keeping them. May your face shine upon them and give them peace today. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. I love you guys, and I hope you'll have a wonderful day. Bye.